right children let's do this question number 9 of exercise 4.2 well this question the determinant entry is the determinant uh, if you just see that there is any common factor available anywhere in any column in any row you can take it outside as one trick you can apply or if some of the entries along a particular row or column is same then you can add the rows and columns these two are not uh, evident over here you have to make the common factor hai. कॉमन फैक्टर नहीं है ना तो हम टोटल देखे कॉलम्स का वो भी रोज का भी सेम नहीं आ रहा है तो ये कुछ ट्रिक्स हैं और क्या ट्रिक हो सकती है इफ यू कैन क्रिएट वन थ्रू आउट इन एनी पर्टिकुलर कॉलम और रो वो एक थर्ड ट्रिक ट्रिक हो सकती है ट्रिक्स तो आप पूरा प्रैक्टिस कर रहे से यू विल गेट मोर एंड मोर आइडियाज सो दिस इज वन ऑफ द ट्रिक की आप थ्रू आउट या तो वन क्रिएट कर सकते हैं यहां पे थ्रू आउट हम वन क्रिएट करने के लिए वी कैन अप्लाई वन आइडिया हियर वी कैन जस्ट मल्टीप्लाई सी या वाई जेड है
you can start this way. Whenever you find the sum of all the columns or sum of all the rows is same, that's the best way to start the answer if you find such type of uh, quick available uh, applying applicable in a question. This is a trick that is applicable if you sum of the same. If you are column wise, you have a row wise option. If you have an option, you have a column wise the same. If you have a column wise or row wise, this time I am doing row wise, applying row 1. I am putting the sum of all the three rows. In row one, you can even start with column. Our column one may sign in a total of columns ka sum dal sakte hain. Main row one mein dal rahi hu total of all the three sums, a total of all the three rows. Sum same hai five x plus four. You can check two x plus x plus four plus two x is same. That's why we put the total of all of them. Common factor available hai. We can take it out. So that is how many is the next step. Remaining two rows as it is as we have and there's any changes in it. Next step, you can take 5x plus 4 common. 5x plus 4 common is the next step. So throughout 1, 1, 1, you get there in the row 1. Remaining 2 rows as it is. Now, you can see, first row is entirely 1. Hai. So what you can do? Those zeros create ka sakte hai. Question number 8, second part. Ke tarah. Jab bhi row, kisi bhi particular row mein, or column mein entirely 1 hai. So usse hum kya ka sakte hai? So our answer jo ana chahiye na, wo 5x plus 4, 4 minus x square cube ko ana chahiye. Note it down here. Abhi 5x plus 4 to i gaya hai. Usko solve kare ko. We will get the remaining factor also. So what are we going to do? We will get both the zeros. Column 2 mein na ki 0 create kar rahi ho. Aur ek column 3 mein kar rahi ho. With the help of column 1. So we will apply these two operations. Let's see what do we get. 5x plus 4 outside the determinant. Wo common x bar 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 rakna hai. We should not ignore it. Wo under determinant ke under kya aata hai. 5x plus 4 outside. Under. 1, column 1 as it is, column 2 means 0, then minus x plus 4, you can check for yourself, it's coming same, 0, 0, column 3 minus column 1, 0, and here it is, minus x plus 4, this is what we are getting, this is coming, let's see, what are we going to get the determinant now, after expanding along, row 1 contains the maximum number of zeros, after expand along row 1, because even column 3 has few zeros, Expand along column 3 also. So you have a choice here. Now expanding along row 1. What do we get? Row 1 you cannot expand here. Delete the row. First row and first column. The cofactor of y is positive here. We will be in the even position. So 4 minus x whole square. That's what we need to prove equal to. So left hand side is equal to right hand side. Prove. Similarly you can do second part of question number 10. Alright. Next we continue with